going to try and secure tickets for this massive football Super game classic. here. Super classic, I basically at Bolivia. See what we can do, see if we can get in. Tickets on door. Welcome, sports enthusiasts, to a place where football reaches new heights, both literally and figuratively. Nestled amid the breathtaking peaks of the Andes Mountains stands the Bolivar Football Stadium. Join me as I embark on a journey to this remarkable arena where every match is played against the backdrop of the majestic mountains. It's actually pretty packed. Yeah, they're pretty wavy. Should we wait for oh. We've got tickets, but we don't know what end we're in. Let's have a talk. Okay. Well, it, the limited, this is the derby. Yeah. Well, the team. This is the colours. The blue. What who, which tickets are these for? Yeah, because we don't know which end we're in. Cool, not, which fans? Bolivia. This is 60 Bolivia. 60. 60. Oh, that is kind of bolted. It, yeah, it, I'll it, get one of them. And, and believe me, look. It's, 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 it's pretty. It's yeah, that's what, some fine what, material. What, that, that's that's actually this. sick. That's a sick top. God, it's rammed in. So many people. Oh. Yes, the stadium has changed so many, so many things. Yeah. Over the past two years, it wasn't the way it is. It was like more less now, more space. Now it's bigger now. Yeah. Now cars go everywhere. Everywhere, man. Yeah. Are you a Bolivia fan? I'm Bolivian, man. Yeah, but I was in LA for 15 years. That's where I learned my That's English. why your English is so yeah, good. Yeah, I learned over there. I was you sound there. like you're from LA. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, one for you, obviously. Okay. Uh, three then. Two each. Can you go inside? Before you guys were allowed to. No, you happen. can't anymore. Not anymore. Uh, one for you. One for you. Thank you, mate. Cheers, mate. If you, if you want to film it, do me a favor. Do it. But help me out with these guys. Yeah. Remember this name, Magic Mike. I'm the original one. Just Magic Mike. The Magic original Mike. Magic Mike. Magic Mike. Go. Believe me, the person from California, the person in Bolivia, California person is person. No kids, no women, but this person, you can have your kids, your women. Why? It's yeah. a city. And they leave it for school. City. And, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I tell you, we have swimming pools, we have steam rooms, we have restaurants. I tell you, it's whatever you see in the streets, we have it inside. But the only thing is inside of a city. You see? That's fucking nice. Guys, mad, cheers, mate. salute. Cheers. Salute. Salute. Give you. Thanks for guys meeting you. Thanks for guys meeting you guys. Thanks for you guys meeting you, you, you guys. No, that's it, that's it. Uh, okay. Come back. Come back. That's it. Ciao. Cheers, mate. Ciao. Ciao. Mate, what legends. They'll be chilling there for free with a beer. All right. Time to try and find the ultras. Pretty wavy, to be honest. Big queue now. Fuck of me. Oh, my God. The queue goes up there. Moment of truth. Do we get in with a ticket that's already been ripped? And we're in. All right, time to find where I am sitting. I think it's just man for every man for themselves out here, really. Oh, mate, it's like looking for a needle in a haystack here. Hola. Uh, north? Curva Norte. Here? All right, let's go upstairs, have a look. Fucking hell, it's rambled. The highest stadium in the world. Literally some mountains over there. To get us through it, I don't know what this is. Doesn't really look like sausage, but it's nice. Ish. Mm. Time. Playing football at such a high altitude presents significant challenges for both teams. The reduced oxygen levels can affect players' endurance and performance, making matches at the Bolivar Football Stadium a true test of skill and stamina. The stadium can hold about 20,000 spectators, and its architecture is designed to withstand the harsh mountainous environment while providing excellent views of the playing field. She loves it, mate. She's getting bare into it. 